guys. Welcome back to today. <clears throat> We're dancing today. school and I'm very upset because all my stuff got soaking wet in my backpack because mom made us put our water bottles in our backpack and my water bottle leaked and everything's soaking wet. Composition notebook. I don't know if this one will last. This one's pretty okay but my folders are completely soggy and they're both ruined and the reason I got another folder is because this folder got soaking wet last time. I'm really mad. A quick snack break. These Sorgento things, not sponsored. The cheddar cheese, chocolate covered peanuts, so good. Banana chip. I don't really like those. And peanut butter chocolate chip, my favorite. They're so good. So, um, I like the natural lighting in here. <laughs> Bad lighting. I have my tea. And my bagel. That is super thin. Very toasted. Lightly buttered. For some reason, it tastes like a quesadilla. Computer and an app binder and that mess over there. I'm gonna do my homework. Oh, I'm gonna study for a test. After doing my homework, I'm gonna tell you guys like what we did today and how school went. But <laughs> let's do my homework. So why I am this boring long clip of doing my homework. <laughs> time lapse and it's still super long because there's so much i'm going to tell you about how my day at school went so first period was dance and we dressed out and which is when we get into our dance clothes and we did ballet and tomorrow we have a quiz and then second period is digital design we just did our beginning of year exam Third period is math. We did another math lesson. Fourth period is humanities. We went over a PowerPoint and a worksheet. Fifth period is lunch, which took forever to get to, and I was starving. Sixth period is language arts, and we did our beginning of year writing exam, which ends tomorrow. Finally, yay. Seventh period was science and we went over our worksheets that we did with the subs the last two days and eighth period is history which was again super boring and we had homework so again my least favorite class <laughs> my history it's at 4 46 i started at 2 4 20. so it's pretty good i'm moving on to math as you can see in a lot of these clips, I have a new snack. That's because when I'm doing homework at home, all I do is eat. It's a terrible habit. I've had like 10 snacks and you'll probably see me eating a lot of my videos because I love food and it's just kind of fun to do when you're eating, <laughs> doing homework, not eating homework. I just have to finish my vocab words 
and do my October 3 homework. And now I'm done. It's nice. It's so wet. Okay. But now I have to study for dance and possibly make flashcards. Once again, you see me with another snack. Of course, this time it's healthy because after I have a few unhealthy snacks, I have to eat something healthy. Okay, guys, so I'm freezing, but I showered, finished my pants. So I also wrote Pebbles my gym video. It was really hard to do because my mom was, and my dad were painting the barn while we were riding. And Brian was riding Toby. It's freezing. But now I'm gonna like um like set up my planner. And I'm actually really excited to set this up. So let's hope we can figure this thing out. As you can see, I've been doing a lot of these voiceovers. It's just fun to add in the videos and less boring because I can find it no good music. But I'm just filling out my planner and looking on Schoology to see the upcoming dates of all my assignments. So I'm just writing this in my planner and if I have more homework, I put that in my planner during the day. Okay, so this is my planner and it's August and September, just like the notes that I can do. So I that is not, that was yesterday. This is today, start of planner, and tomorrow I have dance quiz, last day of VLA, running BOI, and my math lesson, and that's all I have tomorrow so far, but it can change. Also, I have, on Thursday, I have summer reading project due and math notes due. Friday, I have dance goals and accomplishments, dance skill checks, and DOLs, one, D -O -Ls, one through five due. And this is the calendar part, and today's Tuesday, so I crossed it out. Wednesday, I have dance dress out. Thursday, I have dance dress out. Friday, I haven't wrote anything, either the weekend. No school on Monday. Woohoo! Dance dress out. I wrote on all the days I have that. And then this is more September notes. It's kind of confusing, honestly, but I'll get used to it. <laughs> and here's me struggling to flip the page. Happens like 20 times. And these are just more areas to take notes, which I had on the first page, but they're just extra pages. And I honestly have no clue why I'm showing you all of this, but I think this is where I got confused. I'm not really sure. But anyway, that's all the dates. And I thought that the 26, I was like, why is the 26? But there's, as you can see, the left, there's 30 on the other page because it goes like horizontally so and then that's october next month so that's really it for my planner so this is my the front cover of my planner the back cover it's blue with gold polka dots and it has all those tabs and then behind those tabs if i can flip it up is more tabs because it starts of june 2020 and goes until july 2021 so it's perfect for the school year because it has all of our school days in it. And I'm actually really excited to use this. My friend Eliana has one just like it, except it's a different color. And I like it a lot, so I'm glad to try this out. Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Bye!